I have been negotiating since childhood. My dad nicknamed me the negotiator when I was a kid because I was doing it constantly. And one of his favorite stories to tell is that when I was six years old, I found a box of novelty pens in the basement for a then defunct restaurant that he used to own. And they had a fun little suction cup on the end of it. So I asked my dad if I could have one and take it to school. And he said I could since they weren't useful to him anymore. Later that day, I came home from school and I was chewing gum. And my dad asked, where did you get the gum? And I said, from the store next to the school. How did you pay for it? With my money. I didn't give you money. Where did you get the money? I traded it for my pen. You sold my pen? You said you didn't want it. Clearly, from childhood, I was able to spot valuable opportunities. I decided to trade a pen that was worth nothing into something more valuable to me, like gum. As an adult, that led to a pattern of negotiating all sorts of things from every job promotion and salary I've ever had to multiple property purchases, mortgages, cars, not including the ones for friends and family because I'm like that party trick they want to bring everywhere, vacation upgrades, home theater systems, and so much more. According to one study, when I tally up all of these opportunities, I estimate that I have saved myself, or rather I have gained 20 years of early retirement, 20 years. It pains me to hear people say that they have avoided negotiating altogether out of fear. Fear of not being liked, fear of retribution, fear of looking stupid, or fear of losing the deal. Imagine how many years of early retirement you are missing out on because of that fear. What if we could just find a way to communicate more effectively to get what we want? Now, I know you're going, okay, fine, that's easy for you. You've been doing it all your life. But this is not something that you're just born with. I'm gonna tell you the same thing I tell my MBA students. Negotiators are not born, they're made. Otherwise, it would be a waste of time to sign up for my class. I can't just rely on the skills that I had as a six-year-old to do what I do today. It takes lots of effort and practice and the right mindset. And you have time to practice all the time. Whether it's closing a lucrative deal, landing that job promotion, or dealing with an unruly toddler, negotiation comes in all shapes and sizes.